It's an absolute pleasure and a privilege today to be at the home of Al-K Metrology in their production uh, department and I'm joined by John Gray. Now John, you've been with the company for many years. Tell us about um, the history and the heritage behind the production. Well, uh, the company has been going from the early 60s and I actually joined in 1989, uh, but a lot of the staff have remained the same and uh, moved along with the products. A UK manufactured CMM, um, to this day there's still a lot of people that don't even realise that you've got this production facility here in Castle Donington. Yeah, I, th I think over the years uh, there's a lot of competition out there and we've always been probably a smaller company, but we do and have built up uh, an excellent reputation for the machines. Uh, the CMMs that we uh, produce uh, have always sold all around the world and they're, they're a quality product that we've uh, been proud to ship out from the UK. So UK manufactured and, and you've just stated that you, you ship all around the world. Tell our audience what makes um, these CMMs so special in regards to production. Well I, I think first of all over the years they've evolved from uh, probably being antiquated machines with uh, some older materials uh, on the spindle and uh, the, uh, the beams being made of granite and over in the 90s LK become probably the first company uh, to use ceramic and the ceramic technology uh, moved the company forward uh, more than a, a lot of the com competition and even to this day the the qualities of the ceramic uh, are out there uh, because of uh, thermally stable uh, stiffer material and also cosmetically looks a lot better on the machine so with such experienced people that you have working for you here what type of products are, are, are they capable of working on because you have such a large range I think over the years uh, we, the machine range has changed but uh, because a lot of us have been here years we've seen the, the migration from uh, the old bridge, older bridge type machines to the new Altera range that you've, you've seen now. Uh, the Altera range varies in different sizes uh, from the small, medium to the large machines. The smaller ones covering uh, 755 the smallest size and you can go up to the Altera M where the uh, any size in the X virtually uh, 2 meter in the Y axis and 1500 in the Z axis uh, so it, we really can build any size machine that the customer requires and that's one of the strengths of LK sounds like a, like a lot of kind of experience required for a, a knowledge to, to, to kind of work in this production environment could you can you give our audience a little bit of an insight behind your team yeah or into I, your team sorry yeah no the, uh, a lot of the guys here if, if we totted up the years there's a lot of years experience i would say you know well over 200 years experience there's at least seven people who have been here 20 years or more uh, so they're all very comfortable uh, building the machines, they're always giving advice and uh, looking to improve the products all the time. Now, the testing of the CMMs on site, once you've, uh, once you've assembled them, what accreditations do you check them to? Well, once we've calibrated the machine and we know that they can achieve the repeatability spec, uh, we then actually uh, follow a ISO standard, 10360 standard, that uh, then we'll conduct uh, uh, either uh, length measuring tests, either with a laser or length gauges, calibrated length gauges, and then also there'll be probing tests and scanning tests. It all depends on what the customer has ordered with the machine. And a UK manufactured product how important is that John it's it's vital isn't it we we we're really proud of that that a lot of us who have been here years uh, we we've enjoyed the experience of traveling the world to install the machines 
And we've been proud to say that these machines have been built in the UK and a lot of the customers receiving them have also been proud to you know, accept them from the UK.